Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. The TGIF, folks, it was a light week this week, no doubt. The adoption expiration, we'll get to this market. A lot of app action happening. <coughs> Excuse me. To begin a great relationship, know what you want. Know what the needs of your body are, what the needs of your mind are, what fits well with you. There are millions of men and women. Some of them will be good match for you and others won't. The two of you only to be like a key in a lock, a match that works. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 408, NASDAQ down 341, S&P's down 77, gold contract down $11.50, trading at 1831 an ounce. You get silver off 41 cents, 24 dollars, 30 cents an ounce, light sweet crude, down a half a buck, 85 dollars, one penny a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year up 20 ticks, trading 128.11. The 30 year up a full point, plus 20 ticks at 156.03 in King Dollar. King Dollar's down 79 ticks, trading 95.656. Euro is 113, yen is a trading at 113.64, and the British pound is at 135 to one US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at it. What do you have? Well, you have a market that's down. We're going to do the futures first because what you have here, folks, you got an ABC, down, ABC structure on the way down. And you actually have a, a so here, here, here's how the setup is. This is going to get really inter interesting. It's going to take a little more work to really figure where this thing wants to stop but let me give you a kind of a heads up as to what we have here so when you take a look at the the a to b portion of this abc down the a portion starts right at the highs okay 4808 your b point comes down there to 4572 your c point gets up there at uh, 47 let me get the whole thing straightened out so you can see this okay so your c point and then we bring this down what did I say? It's 43.74. So you got 43, somewhere right here. So what you have is that we're, we're on an ABC down. When you do a 1 to 1.618, folks, okay, whether it's going down or up, what I've found on, on a very consistent basis is that's where you turn around in the marketplace. So my take goes like this. The lowest swing point, well, the, the high of the low out here is 3.56. We're at, that's 43.56. We hit 43.93. That's where we're at right now. 43.74 is your ABC structure down when it's a 1 to 1.618. My take, this thing is going to go down. The S&P, the S&P has been the strongest. That's going to try to get down and get into that bar from October 1st to October 4th. They kind of laid it the same thing. That's how it's laid out. We go take a look at the NDX 100, and this is where it's going to get dicey, and this is why. So, NQ. We take a, take a look at the NQs, and what you have with the NQs, you, you're down 368 bucks. We've been talking about, you know, the October 4th level. The, bar, the low of the level is 14,366. Bottom line, we've made it to 14,457. This is going to get down there. Now, and here's the kicker. We're going to go over to the composite, because... Okay, so now let's do the NASDAQ composite. The reason we're going to the composite is that the composite has already given us a heads up that it blew away October 4th like sliced butter, man. I mean, not even close. We're 300 points under, under that. So what do you do? Bottom line, you've got to go to your weekly, and you're, gonna, you know, you're not going to like what I say, but the bottom line is that you know, this is where this market wants to go. So what you have here is this. You can see that we blew away that October, the week of October 8th, October 4th, the whole ball of wax, okay? That sets up all the way down here now for March 5th, which is 12397 And guess what? We do this, let me pull this up for a second, and just put a retracement up. That, if that's what we get to, that is also the 0 .382 of an ABC, no, not an ABC, contraction of where we've been. So, let's go through this. If you're a bull, this is what you're looking for. You do not want this to stop right now if you're a bull. 
Because what happens, folks, is this. If this market stops here, I, my, my take is not. My take is going to be a nasty close, and we're coming into a really nasty close that you probably haven't seen in a long time. We'll be down 100 S&P points. We're only down 83 right now. So what happens is that if you make your full price projection and the market doesn't get any relief, that is a much better situation for a bull. And the reason being is that then it exhaust itself. If you're a bear, what you want to see is actually you want to see a bounce come in. And then you want to see a sideways move happening for three or four days because that would be the building cause of get to the next level. The overall picture to me is that we are in a monster correction and this is only the beginning of it. And if, you know, so we'll take this step by step. And the way that the S&P is trading, it would tell me that if we, if we hit the number that we're talking about, the 4374, without stopping, and that would be a good situation that then you would get a really nice bounce. The real kicker is going to be after that is that as you get the bounce, does the bounce come in light volume again? Because if it comes on light volume again, that's saying you're not done. That's, that's, that's how these things shake out, folks, okay? Um, if we go take a look at the tick, we know that we've been watching the tick. The tick has come in, but the trend hasn't come in. Now, look at the tick came in today. The tick came in. Just make sure this is not the opening tick. Come in at minus 1900. No, it's, look at this, the same, same time. Right, right when I'm getting on the air. Yeah, so you get a minus 1911, which is a great indication, okay, that you know you get a lot of selling. And uh, here we go. Now you're talking. Okay, so what has happened so far today is that the arms has got up to 1.73. That's what you need. This is the type. So you finally have some fear in the marketplace. See this 1.73, folks? Um, this, is not, this is not even close to a bottom yet. I can tell you this, though, because that thing, the five days got to get to like eight, somewhere around there, and you can see a five day on this one here. We're still only one, two, three, four. You're, they are five, you know, so we still get some time here, man. Stay right there, folks. We're coming right back. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. You have the Dow Industrials off 410. NASDAQ's down 390. Free 40, S&P's off 77, we'll come right back.